I think it's something that the human race shares as a community. You know, it's a, it's a very kind of deep, inbuilt passion that everyone has. In some people, it needs to just be unlocked, you know. When did I first realise I had a passion for fire? Well, it was undoubtedly as a, as a child, I was probably five or six. My father would, would light a fire out in the garden. We'd have bonfires all the time. That really sparked my interest. But yeah, I was very small. I was barely as tall as the fireplace itself. Now that we have modern equipment, do we take fire and warmth for granted? I, I think we do. I think that's always been the case, but more so now. Uh, all these modern conveniences, they do lead to a, a, a complacency, I think. But if you in, engage with the natural world and you, you go back to even simple, simple skills, the fire making skills, it helps you reconnect and it really gives you an appreciation of, of what we have. On, on the one hand, it's a book for the serious kind of wilderness adventurer, practical, um, you know, life-saving advice in that. On the other hand, uh, if, you know, mother and daughter or parent and child want to have fun in the, in the back garden without even stepping foot in the, in the wilderness, it's a book you can look through, go out into the outdoors, into your back garden and have fun with. But it's got a serious message as well. My favourite fire-making technique, it has to be the hand drill. The hand drill is the most widespread friction fire-making technique. It was used all, all over the world. The, the real kind of interesting thing about it is the, the elegance of it. It's so elegant, uh, it's very simple. When you see native people using it, it's so elegant. Just two sticks, twirl it between the hands and they get fire. The reason I learned bushcraft skills is to take me to, to the wilderness, to take me to places where I can observe the forest in its pristine state and the wildlife that inhabit it. I'd like readers to connect with the natural world and they can do that in a number of ways, but I think none is as powerful as fire. When you light a fire, it promotes conversation and laughter, camaraderie. It's, it's an incredibly human thing. It's what sets us apart from the other animals. My book, one, brings a sense of fun. People have fun with it, but also reconnecting with the natural world. <laughs>